Let's follow the product journey of ore from the ground to the off-site transport terminal and see how Cisco wireless technology ensures the process is safer and more efficient. Maria, a mine engineer, is poring over geological data to identify what part of the mine should be extracted next. Since the company adopted autonomous mining technology for drilling, dozing, and hauling, she can now consider areas for mining that were too dangerous before. What makes autonomous extraction possible is wireless communication to each piece of heavy equipment at the face. Autonomous haul trucks need fast roaming to stay connected, and the remote-controlled dozers require high bandwidth for a reliable video feed. Since implementing this automated solution, labor costs have dropped by as much as 70%. Production time is nearly 100%, and personnel can avoid many dangerous mine situations. Today, Maria carefully reviews the data and discovers she has some new options. The autonomous mine solution enables her to plan for more profitable extraction in dangerous areas without risking the safety of mine personnel. Andrew, a plant operator, works in an operations center that manages all the material movement and separation processes at the plant. Hundreds of operational data points are monitored today, whereas a few dozen key metrics were visible before through their DCS system. Installing cable in the plant is very expensive, and only measurements needed for process control were initially connected by cabling. All other measurements were manually collected by operators like Andrew. Since installing Wi-Fi access points across the plant, the manual collection is no longer required because all new instrumentation is wirelessly connected to the network. And each access point can also communicate directly with industrial instrumentation using wireless heart. For legacy instrumentation, an industrial router converts serial communications to Wi-Fi, so there is no need for expensive cable installation. Andrew notices an unusually high temperature reading from a bearing on a crusher conveyor, a condition they couldn't have seen before the new wireless system. Andrew opens a conveyor ticket to proactively replace the bearing and avoid a costly unscheduled downtime event. Jacques is a manager at a shipping port where the processed material is shipped to customers. He gets the product delivered from the mine's processing plant via train. This morning, Jacques receives a call from his dock supervisor with an urgent issue. Communication at the port has been great since installing their own LTE network because the nearest public LTE network is hundreds of kilometers away. Now they can reliably make phone calls, get instrumentation data, and locate assets with standard LTE devices. This morning's issue is related to a mobile conveyor normally kept at the port for loading ships but it was missing this morning when a ship pulled in for loading. Jacques pulls up his asset map and discovers the conveyor was moved to augment the unloading efforts of a nearby train. Being able to locate assets immediately and call managers on a phone makes it faster and easier to resolve issues. Since deploying Cisco Edge solutions, the mine company has significantly improved efficiency and safety while reducing costs.